would like to salute the men and women who wear the uniform of the United States and the workers and their families who will be building this great carrier. Let me thank everybody involved in making this genuine dream a reality and in so doing serving our nation in a way that transcends uh, any individual honor involved in the production of this mind-boggling vessel. I want to salute first all the shipbuilders uh, for putting this thing together. Uh, it is an absolutely amazing piece of work. As the ship sponsor, I'm particularly honored 
to have this first opportunity to meet some of the sailors and officers who will operate aboard CVN 77 or what we in our family are calling the USS Dad. the happiest day in my life. And to say that I'm pleased to be here is a classic understatement of the year. This is any naval aviator's dream come true. May God watch over all those who sail this ship, all those who fly from her, their deck, and all those at home who pray for their safe return. My honor to bring to you the 41st president a great dad, George H.W. Bush. I can't wait to see this remarkable state-of-the-art vessel go to sea. And when it does, I want to get permission from the Commander-in-Chief to be on board. I'm finishing, Lord, I'm finishing. Don't worry about it. I christen the United States ship George H.W. Bush. May God bless all who sail her.